So today we're back with one of my favorite series. I'm gonna be playing the most popular One Piece games on Roblox, but that's not all. In each game we play, I'm gonna be obtaining and mastering the rarest devil fruit that game has to offer and rate each of them out of five to find out which game has the best devil fruit. And for the first game, we're playing King's Legacy. All right, now I'm on a brand new account on this just so we can actually master out the rarest fruit, which I actually have no idea what it is. So let's go ahead and figure that out. I think there's a black market right over here. Okay, so they have common rarity. That's obviously not good uncommon rarity let's see rare i'm assuming they're probably be like mythic right epic and i guess the highest is legendary okay is phoenix the highest there's no way phoenix is the most expensive let me see okay phoenix is 2250 robux what about doe doe is 2850 and dragon is 3250 damn now the way i say it, we only have three ways to obtain the dragon fruit we can either roll it through the gotcha right here which we only have like less than a one percent chance of getting we can get it through trading which is going to be also hard because i have no fruit in my inventory and then the last one we can do pay to win and just pull out my wallet and buy it. Which one do you guys think I'm going to do? Yeah, we're going to pay to win. Of course. <laughs> of course, we're going to pay to win, bro. Wouldn't be a Winter Crowds video if I wasn't spending Robux. What the hell is this giraffe doing right here, dog? Why bro so buff like that? Yo, chill. <laughs> okay, let's go buy some Robux. I'm going to go with the $100 package because I'm, I'm pretty sure we're going to be buying a bunch of Robux this video. See my Robux right now? 358 With the snap of this finger, I'll have 10 k Look at that, boys. All right, now that I just broke my wallet into pieces, let's go ahead and buy this dragon fruit. It's about to be 3250 down the drain, but it's for a good cause. Y'all's entertainment. Let's Let's get it, boys. No going back now. Equip the dragon fruit, and there we go. All right, let's see what we're working with. So we need 2,000 points in order to unlock the last ability. Now, I have no idea how long that's going to take us, but let's go ahead and get to the first quest and get to grinding. Let me put up like uh, an hour of two times EXP. Let's get that. That should be good enough. I think this is the first quest right here. This little baddie right there. Yeah, chill. Can you help me kill four soldiers? All right, say less, say less, say less. Now, let's go ahead and check out this first ability, Hell Bullet. Boom. Okay, okay. That's actually not that bad. That's actually not that bad. I just straight up demolished that soldier, bro. Hold on. Let me gather all these boys up let me see let me see hit him like this hell bullet boom oh damn that's cake look at our levels five six okay okay we already have six levels let me see how much stats we actually get for a level okay we already have 24 points let me go ahead and put that into power fruit let's go ahead and do another one of these quests all right so i killed a bunch more clowns boys and i'm level 21 now and i'm able to fight someone named Smokey. and it says he's a strong man you know what i'm down for the challenge let's go pack that boy up while he's standing up there yo chill bro get your ad down here you ain't above me boom oh wait oh, wait i actually didn't one shot this dude hold on hold on he actually had a challenge he actually challenge boom what's good g what's good boom 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 pack him up oh wait damn he actually doing damage let me run let me run let me run hell bullet boom 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 damn that was that was easier than i thought and now we are on the final boss of the first island tashigi why she dressed up like that too oh, oh, oh hold on damn 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 i was just trying to check you out you ain't friendly huh you ain't friendly huh yeah get packed up tashigi get packed up i've just reached level 50 and the leveling is starting to get slow so i think this is where i need to move on to the next island let me get my robot out and let's sail also we have some stat points in here we got 40 we're now at 200 power fruit when we're at level 50 so soon we'll have that next ability pirate island huh hopefully this is the correct one let me check my map real quick yep level 50 yep, someone enabling the pvp here huh Are these boys fighting let me let me just interrupt this hold on hold on hold on can i even fight these boys can i even fight these boys oh, oh that, damn how did he just one shot did he just send me back to the start I no we're going on a revenge arc boys we're going on a revenge arc we will not let that slide i'll track that man down to the depths of the earth till i get my get back where is he at where is he at did he leave the sir there's no shot there's no shot this man left before i could get him all right let's stop wasting time the first quest is right here defeat six clown swordsmen all right let's do it let's do it i'm sure these boys are no more tougher than oh my god he got me to half health in one hit okay okay hold on hold on these boys be business let me chill let me chill let me chill if i die i'm gonna get set straight back to the starter island i don't know where the set spawn is here never mind i just found it let me set it there all right got the last clown right here yes sir there we go seven levels off one quest okay we zooming now we zooming now boys I'm glad we got our starter island let me gather these boys up again let's go on a little training arc All right, we're level 77, which means I think we can go ahead and accept the next quest. Hold on, someone's fighting the boss. Hold on, let me go quick, quick, accept the quest. Come on, come on, come on. Let me get credit, let me get credit. What the hell is that? What is this? Is this some sort of event? I, mean, I just killed somebody. I didn't even mean to kill him. What is this? Why is there a bunch of people yeah. chasing after me? Well, damn, they just one-shot at me. Let's go back up there, boys. I don't know what the hell that is. I want a part of it, though. Boom. Why are they so strong? I've hit them with everything. They're, they're not dying. Okay, we could do it together, Bacon. We could do it together, Bacon girl. Boom. Weave all these boys. Weave all these boys. Hell's bullet. There we go. She killed the boss. She killed the boss. So I'll get credit from that. Now we just have to defeat this one boss here we go here we go he's one tap boys he's one tap hell bullet and there he goes oh there's a chest right here let's see what it gives me let's see what it gives me come on obtain six candy and five k this dude got a devil fruit where's my devil fruit nah dude i just got scammed all right here we go clown down all right we're level 101 this means i gotta go over to the next island now before we do that let me go and put some more stats and we have 204 available only 100 points are left before we get our first ability here we go let me get this quest real quick let me go steal this guy's kill let me go steal this guy's kill boom boom, boom. there we go. <laughs> 
Why did I do that? That's so mean. I'm gonna do it again. He just left the game. Oh, that's crazy. That's toxic. I, I, I can't believe I just made that man leave the game. All right, boys. We're level 125. About to unlock our next ability now. 20 in there and 500. Disaster Storm. Okay, let's test the thing out. Disaster Storm. Sheesh. Okay, okay. That thing gotta cook it. That thing gotta cook it. Not bad, not bad. That's gonna take us a minute. I ain't gonna lie. 15 minutes later. All right, here we go. First quest, defeat four trainer chefs. Okay, easy enough. Just these guys right here. Let me see how hard these guys could be. Disaster storm. A bullet. Boom. Last one right here. As soon as I get this move, I'll cool down. Boom. There we go. Let me put some points in. There we go. 12 points available. Let me put that in there. And we have a thousand. We've unlocked our third ability, Roar. Let's go ahead and check that thing out. Boom. Oh, damn. That thing does damage. That thing does damage. Hold on, hold on. Let me say that again. So this guy's full health right here, right? Let me hit him with that roar. Yo, that basically one shot him. Yo, this ability, that changes things for us. That actually changes things for us. I'm not going to lie. We only have a little bit more to go before we unlock our next two abilities, boys. We're making good progress. We moved up to the next quest. Defeat the Dark Leg. Bro, his name is Sanji, which means Dark Leg. <laughs> All right, though. Let's get, let's lock in, boys. Let's lock in. He's about to uh, hit him with that. And be able to, uh, 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 boom. I honestly thought all three of those would one-shot him. All good, though, all good, though, because he's about to get packed up here. There we go. Look at my stats. We also have 1,232. So 200 stats away from getting our next ability. Here we go. I'm finally the final boss of Baratie. Except we're still about to just demolish this dude. Yeah, that was, that was really anticlimactic. I'm not going to lie. But I believe we have enough points to get our fourth ability. There we go. Full form. Let's waste no more time, boys. She, bro, it's been almost two hours of grinding and we finally got our dragon form, boys. Let's see what the abilities look like now. Hell bullets. Oh, damn. That got way bigger. Hold on. That, that, I'm drowning. Oh, drowning. Damn. That thing's kind of hard to control. Hold on. Hold on. Let's see. Disaster storm. Oh, it's a tornado now. Tatsumaki. Okay. Okay. Let's check out roar. Okay. It's basically the same thing. The last ability we need requires 2,000, boys. 2,000. We almost there. One thousand nine hundred fifty-two in power fruit. We have less than fifty more points away till we get our final ability, boys. Eight points left, boys. This next kill will get us our ability. Boom, roar, fire ability. There we go. And two thousand four power fruit. We now have our final ability, which is dragon breath, boys. And without further ado, let's check it out. Full form, and then followed by dragon breath. Woo! Wait, look at that. Hold that thing. Sheesh. That did crazy damage too. I know that did crazy damage. So that is all for king's legacy i'm not gonna lie for this dragon the way this is looking sheesh all the abilities the dragon model itself we're starting out strong i gotta give this probably a four out of five i'll give this a four out of five next up we got the new game of the block haze piece now this is a fairly new decently popular one piece game at least it's fairly up there on the list so we're playing it today i'm gonna be honest i actually have no idea what the most popular fruit in the game is luckily we got ourselves a fruit dealer here wouldn't be a one piece game if there wasn't a fruit dealer am i right let's go ahead and talk to him let's see what he's got okay so they got the typical rares the legendaries and then they have mythicals okay so the most expensive fruit in the game in this game is dough oh interesting let me get that right there all righty all righty let's see what we got here okay so we need 150 stat points to unlock the final move we have power mochi grilled mochi dough minigun rapid punches ultimate buzz cut and rolling donuts say less say less that shouldn't take too long then or at least i hope not king's legacy took us like three hours before he unlocked all those moves let me see where's the first quest at amelia right here Group of thugs are terrorizing our village. Please help us get rid of them. All right, Sayless, I got you. I got you. I can't even use my devil fruit to start off with because that's kind of it's kind of trash. I don't even have any combat abilities, but I literally just have to pack them up with bare fists. Last thief right here. Boom. And there we go. We're level six. All right, let me see how many stat points we actually got. Okay, 15. Not bad, not bad. You know, I'm not here to waste time. Let me do 30 minutes of two times EXP, boys. Yeah, right there. All right, let me do the same quest and let's see which levels we get this time. Here we go. Boom. And we're level 10. Okay, so we only got four levels from that. Double XP hardly did anything. Let me go back to my stat points though and put some more in there after i complete this quest we'll be able to unlock our first ability which is power mochi so let me just make quick work of these boys last guy here and there we go level 15 we 100 have enough to get our first ability now boom 42 stat points let's check out that first ability first off we got roller donut Ooh, is this thing flying oh it bounces it bounces a lot bro i like this i like this can it go on water let me see oh it can go on water yo that's fire i can use this as transportation and we also have power mochi our first actual attack ability oh nice little hold animation i like how this look boom the heck dog all right let's check that again power mochi i don't know how they managed to make a mochi ability anticlimactic but they did it is what it is it is what it is all right i'm now level 26 which means we can move on to the final quest 
in the first island. Watch out, the bandit boss is in town and he's not supposed to be underestimated. Please save us by defeating him. I got you, don't worry. Okay, hold on, hold on. This little, this little bandit right here is pissing me off. There we go. All right, we also have a bunch of stat points that I saved up, 33. So we're definitely gonna be able to get our next ability off that. Look at that, we got our next one, Grilled Mochi. We can test that out on the boss right now. Bandit boss right here, Grilled Mochi. <laughs> God, they are not cooking with this. They are not cooking. They actually are doing dough injustice by this. I still have hope for some of these other ones, though, like dough minigun and rapid punches. Those better be fired. Power mochi. Boom. And there he goes right there. Boss down. Let me get him again. Boom. And level 37. We're at 108 fruit stat already, bro. We've unlocked our next ability, dough minigun. Let me see. Dough minigun. Please be fired. Please be fired. Oh, okay. That's actually not that bad. I like that. I like that. That's our best move we have thus far. Also, now that we're level 40, we can go to the next island they told us right over there. I'm going to roll the donut my way over there. Which is going to be the clown island. Yep. Typical Roblox One Piece game trope. These pirate clowns are a joke without a punchline. Why don't you help by delivering one right in their face? <laughs> okay, okay. I'll give, him, I'll give him credit. I'll give him credit. Let me help him out by gather these boys up. Let me jump up. Domain gun. Okay, we can actually farm these boys like this. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, we got to level 44 just off that one quest. Let me check my stats. 21. 129. Oh, we already got our next ability, rapid punches. We only have one more ability to unlock after that. Our journey in this game is coming to an end quicker than I thought it would. Let's check out this next ability though. Rapid punches. Okay, this is a little charging. This is a little charging. Hmm, okay, 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 okay. We're cooking with that. We're cooking with that. We can work with that. I can work with that. Not the best dope barrage I've seen in a One Piece game, but that is not bad. That's not bad. All right, boys. This is the last clown quest of the video. There we go. Boom. And we should have enough points to get our last ability. Six. There we go. 153. Ultimate buzz cut. They better cook with this. Ultimate buzz cut. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, they, 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 they did cook. They did cook. Okay, I'll give it to them. I'll give it to them. They cook with that one. Sheesh. All right, now that is it for Haze Piece. This was a little tough because like half the boost sets kind of mid, but these last two and the Rilla Donut was kind of cooking, bro. You know, bro, I'm going to also give this a four because I don't feel like it's much better or I don't feel like it's much worse than King's Legacy's best fruit was. So four for Haze Piece. Next up, though, we have Fruit Battlegrounds. Okay, boys, so if you go over to the spin tab right over here, right, and you look at the Mythic tab, it says 0.1. 0.19%. Now, if you click on that, there are two fruits that are the rarest in the game. We have the Nika fruit, which is gear five, and the Dragon V2 fruit, which is Dragon Awake. And I'm gonna be honest, I have both of those fruits right here, bro. Dragon V2 fruit right here, and the Nika gear five fruit here. And uh, for this one, we're gonna go with the Dragon V2 just to see how good this one is. Now, obviously, I already have Dragon V2 obtained in this game, but I don't have it fully mastered. You guys can see I'm only level 112 in the upper left corner. And to get our last ability, we need to be level 155. So, you know what that means, boys? We got some grinding to do but first of all let's go ahead and do it with move showcase first things first you guys can see we have this meter bar off to the right which means when that's full we can transform into the you know the dragon of course we also have this club which is kaido's club which has m1s in this which is cool and you know what i see someone right in front of me that's perfect that's perfect let's go check out our first ability inferno breath yeah nah 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 get over here bro get over here i got my eyes locked on you target locked inferno breath yes sir you guys can see inferno breath is a beam that you can charge next up we have thunder bagua boom Oh, I just straight up missed that. Okay, what about Dragon Twister? You straight up just chuck a tornado at this dude. While we're at it, let's check out Thunder Bagua once again. Did that man just get glitched in the build? Where did that man get flung to, bro? Oh, there he is. There he is. Where you think you're going? Where you think you're going? Front of breath. Boom. And GG. Okay, so that's the first three abilities. I see someone else down there. Let's check out the fourth one, which is the last one we have. Nah, nah, nah. You ain't running now, bucko. You is not running now. I see you in my sights. And you ain't getting away this time. Damn. What the heck was Fruit Z at? Is that smoke? Nah, you're not, you're not about to win with smoke, bro. Let me hit him with this last one. Beast Bellow. Boom. Yep. You hit him with that roar. And hit him with that. GG. Nice 100 bounty. So yeah, those are all the moves we have currently unlocked right now. And as you guys can see, this thing is, it is pretty deadly, I must say. All right. So I'm not going to lie. We are strong right now, but not strong enough, dog. We don't have all of our abilities. We need that transformation. We got to go on our little training arc, bro. I got this guy right here, though. Boom. Let's just quickly pack him up. What's good? G. What's good? Thunder bark. Hit him with that dragon twister. Oh, it hit him. It hit him. Hold on, hold on. Where's he at? Where's he at? Where's he at? Let me follow up with this. Oh, yeah, G. Oh, yeah. Wait, where did he go? Don't tell me he got glitched in this building, bro. How do they keep getting away, dog? What? Oh, he's in the building. Hold on. I got it here. I got it here. Yes, sir. We in here now, bucko. We in here now. Boom. Hit him with that. Hit him with this bellow. Dragon 
twister. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Get packed up, bucko. Get packed up. And GG. Now the question is, how the hell do I get out of here? Yo, actually, though, imagine I just stayed in here and AFK grinded. it. This is perfect because no one could get inside. Yes, sir. I got my tiny task out. We about to AFK this thing. Five hours later. All right. It's been a bunch of hours. You guys can see in the upper left corner, we're level 194. We are one level away from unlocking our final ability, boys. There we go. Level 195. Ali, that was like six hours of AFKing right there. Now that we've unlocked all the moves, I could just boringly show y'all the moves right now on nobody, or we could join the public server, pack up some players. What do y'all think we about to do? We pack it up players, of course, and there's a guy right over there. Hold on, hold on. Transform? She. You see this right here? Hold on. Let me pack him up. Oh, you ain't going nowhere, bucko. You ain't going no Nope. Nope. Oh my God. There's no way he just ran the safe zone. That is crazy. We got another guy right here though, and I ain't letting this dude run. Thunder Bagua. Boom. Oh, oh, there's a guy over here. There's a guy over here. What is good, G? What is good? Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. He gets some good hits. He gets some good hits. No more though. No more, bucko. No more. We're about to get our bar full. We're about to get our bar full. Hold on. 100%. Boom. There we go. There we go. We're about to check out this final ability, boys. Demolition. As soon as I get this boy. As soon as I get this boy. Come down here, bucko. Yep. Hit him like this. M1. Get him there. Demolition. Boom. Oh, oh. Got him there. Yo. Damn. Damn. Sheesh. Yo, that move will never get old. That move will never get old, bro. It's been a while since I've seen that thing. Look at this guy. Look at this guy dressing up as Gojo. Mind his own business. Demolition. Boom. Slam him up. Grab him there. Grab him by the throat. Oops, oops. Throw him up in the air. Hit him up, hit him straight down. And we killed him with that, got 430 bounty. Sheesh. Hey, bro, all things considered, bro, they they put their heart and soul into this fruit. I got to give this a five out of five. It would be criminal to not give this a five, bro. What the heck? Bro, someone attacking me, bro. I'm trying to trying to do my little outro, bro. Relax. Hold on, let me quickly pack this dude up before we move on to the next game. He asked for it, boys. He asked for it. No, sir, bro. No, sir. Beast Bellow. Boom. You ain't getting away, bucko. You is not getting away, bucko. Not on me, dog. Easy hunter bounty. Now with King's Legacy out the way, though, the next game we have is Blocks Fruits. Now, Blocks Fruits has been getting a ton of new fruits added recently, but the best fruit that reigns above them all and the most rarest is the Kitsune Fruit, which is 4,000 Robux. That's like $50, boys, in case y'all didn't know. Now, me, I'm not going to spend that much Robux. We've already spent a ton of Robux in this video. I have the physical Kitsune right here. And on this account, I I've never used it. So you guys get the opportunity to watch me fully master out this thing. There we go. Blocks Fruits Kit Suit activated. So first off, you guys can see I have a tail now, which is kind of interesting. We also have a bar right here, which whenever it goes up, the tails go up with it. Without further ado, let's go ahead and check the first ability though. A cursed enchantment. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Blue flame holding. Never gets old seeing that. Them effects, A1 right there. Basically, you just put these little flames on them, which take a second to activate and it does good damage. Also the M1s, yep, they stun. So this is easily already one of the best fruits in Blocks Fruits just off those M1s alone. And look, right there, you guys can see we've gone up to two tails, boys. Look at that. Also, we reached Mastery 56, which means we unlocked our next ability, Tails of Braiding Agony. But here's another thing. It's a multi-target hitting move. So let me gather up all three of these boys so y'all can see what it looks like. Let me run around them. Tails of Braiding Agony. See, it gathers all three of them. You can chain that together with all the other moves. So it's easy, light work. Also, you guys can see I've gotten to three tails now and the bar is glowing, which means it's completely full. This means we'd be able to transform to the final form, but obviously we have that move locked. And Stone is down. There we go. Let's see. Can we get our third ability? Yes, sir. Foxfire Disruption. Let's go ahead and show this off real quick, boys. Let's go ahead and show this off. Where are they at? Where are they at? Foxfire Disruption? Look at that. Look at that. Ah, uh, that move is so fire, bro. That move is so fire. Okay, we have two abilities left to unlock. Transformation and Wild Assault. Let's go fight another boss to get those. With this next ability, she should die. Boom. Foxfire Disruption. There she goes, though. Come on. Give me 200. There we go. 200 Mastery. All right, boys. Next ability, Wild Assault. Wild Assault. Basically, you lunge at him and hit him with like a, a mini version of the M1 combo. We only have one more ability to unlock it. That's the final ability transformation. Let's make this quick. Let's make this quick. We're going to do a little training montage time, boys. Two ninety eight mastery boys, successful montage. There we go. Two ninety nine mastery. Three hundred. There we go. Sheesh. Let's finally check out the last ability though. Transformation. Sheesh. Look at that thing right here. Now this mythical beast is not based off of any actual fruit in One Piece. They actually just like pulled this out of nowhere and made this up. But it is a dope fruit nonetheless. I will say that. Now with the transformation, some of our abilities have changed though. Like a cursed enchantment that does something completely different. Now. Instead, what it does now, you hit him, it slams him back, and hits him with a 
blast. Also, Tales of Burning Agony does something different too now. You guys can see. Look at this. Boom. Grabs them up. Slams them down. Foxfire Disruption is the same thing, as you guys can see. And uh, Wild Assault is also the same thing. So I must say, bro, they cooked with Kitsune 100%. Like, look at this. It walks on water. It's fast as hell. One of the fastest fruits in the game. Damage is really good. Also has damage reduction. What more could you ask for? I'll tell you what more you could ask for. PvP capabilities. And this, it's got it down packed. Let me show y'all. Got someone chilling out here. Hold on. Let me grab him. Boom, 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 boom. Hit up there. Boom. Pack him up. Pack him up. Look at, look. He's already almost dead. He's already almost dead with only, only two abilities. Hold on. Damn, 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 damn. These, boys, these people fighting back. These people fighting back. Watch for disruption. Boom. Oh, oh you want to fight me, huh? You want to fight me, huh? Pack him up. Hit him there. Damn, am I getting three v one? Three people on me is crazy, bro. This is how destructive Kitsune is. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm getting, I'm getting three v one. Give me three v one. Give me three v one. Oh my gosh, bro, that is insane. We ain't about to end off on no L, boys. We is not about to end off on no L. Hold on, let me come up here. Boom. Pack this dude up. Okay, hold on, hold on. It's getting action. It's, it's, it's getting active out here, boys. Hit this dude with curse, cham it. Boom. Hit it with this. And one and one one. Fox fire disruption. Boom. Got one dude there. Oh, we have one more dude. We have one more. We have one more. What's good, G? What's good, G? Curse the champion. Boom, 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 boom. Let me go over here. Hit with that Fox Fire Disruption. Boom. Got him there. Oh, we got another one. Transform full form. What's good, G? What's good, G? Mm -mm. Get him there. Get him there. Get him there. Where he go? Where he go? Where he go? Fox Fire Disruption. Boom. Get him there. Boom. And GG. Y'all see that, boys? We literally beat three people in a matter of seconds. What's good with this guy? What's good with this guy? What's good, What's good with this guy? What's good with this guy, huh? Boom. Boom. One more. And one. Sheesh. Four people in a matter of seconds, boys. Four people. Hey, man. All things considered, Kitsune is a damn near perfect fruit. But I got to give it a 4.9 because I believe the Fruit Battlegrounds Dragon V2 is just ever so slightly better, man. So 4.9 for Kitsune. But with that, we only have one more game remaining to rate, and that is a One Piece game. Now, for this game, it's kind of hard to determine what the rarest fruit is because instead of having specific fruit percentages they just have rarities so they have the common rarity uncommon rare legendary and then they have mythical but all the mythicals are the same percentage so for this i'm just going to showcase the rubber fruit which is a mythical and then we'll show off all the gears only problem is i believe i got rid of my rubber fruit last time i played this we're using the buddha fruit right now let me see did i get rid of my rubber fruit let me check let me check let me check my storage oh we have the rubber fruit already equipped say less that's perfect that's perfect we don't even need the spin for it then okay so we have a bunch of different moves that's with this we have the base form we have snake man form gear fifth and bounce man let's just quickly zoom through this we have pistol for the first ability which i guess you know what i'm saying it's cool it's cool we have bazooka oh my god that, that animation straight dog water we have gatling which i've always hated the gatling in this game because it doesn't even stun you can see i'm hitting them and they're just straight walking towards me still last but not least we have rocket which you know is all that's, that's probably the best animation move wise uh in base form next though we have gear fourth bounce man you know what i'm saying i like that they recently updated this one too because the new way this looks looks fire we have m1s with this oh we do have m1s with this okay i like that i like that i like that we actually have sound effects now they get points for that they get points for that uh we have gomu gomu no culverine which is the first ability I'm pretty sure this is a long range ability that track yep we have gomu gomu no kong gun next let's check that out damn i did that wrong okay let's try that again i aimed that completely wrong okay one more time boom oh, okay that's nice that's nice we cook a little bit we cook a little bit gomu gomu no gatling the next one. Oh, kong gatling oh that actually that, that's the that's the best looking move set so far we have next up we have bounce flight which is the rocket flight i guess kind of kind of goofy and static looking but you know it's not bad it's not bad last but not least we have gomu gomu no kong over gun let's check that out Boom. We de-transform. Let's check out that snake man now. All right. All right. Let's go ahead and review this thing now. We have way less moves than this one. We don't have any M1s as well for this, which I guess kind of makes sense. First move, we have Jeff Culverine. Oh, they added sound effects for this one too. Okay, I like that. Homing Culverine. Let's check that one out. Oh, those are basically the same abilities. Okay, Black Mamba. Let's see this. Black Mamba. Okay, okay, okay. I like that. I like that. I like that. They cook it. They cook it a little bit with this. And then last but not least, we have King Cobra. Uh, I ain't gonna lie. Three of those abilities kind of look the same. All right, with that out the way, we have one final ability. And this one, they have to cook for. Yeah, this. Look at that. Nice little animation. Fire, fire. Mess with that. Mess with that. Look at the look at the Luffy model too. This is this is heat. This is heat. We have M ones with this. No, we don't. But we do have a bunch of different moves. You got Stomp is a first first one fire can't go wrong with that it's pretty accurate too all right next up we have hand clap hand clap boom animation was a little wonky for that one i'm not gonna lie kaminara this one's my favorite if i remember correctly yep you've got the little comic book zaps peering around it this has got long range too so let me hit those ones over there look at that look at that we have drums of liberation which you can only use when you're low actually let me demonstrate that real quick let me go to this boy come on get me low bucko get, get me low bucko hold on will this kill him yeah it straight up kill him okay i guess we can't demonstrate drums of liberation but i'll tell you what we can demonstrate cloud flight yes sir similar to to the uh gear fourth flight i feel like this looks a little static it's like not really much of an animation so not that good 
not that good. Last but not least, though, we have the best move in the entire kit. Bajaranga. Boom. So overall, for one of the rarest fruits in the game, the rubber fruit, um, in this game, it's, it's it's all right. It's all right. I mean, could be better. Could be better with the animations, I feel, but it's not bad. Now, I'm not going to lie. All things considered, if I had to give us a rating, what's a good rating to give this? I have to give it like a 3.9, man. I think Hayes Peace King's Legacy and a One Piece game are all around the same level in terms of visually, man. So, boys, there you have it right there. In first place, we had Fruit Battlegrounds with the Dragon V2. Second place, we had Blockstress for Kitsune. And for third place, I'd honestly have to say probably King's Legacy with the Dragon. Comment down what you would rate him and who you thought won instead. But with that, if y'all enjoyed this video and want to see more like it, make sure to click this video on the screen here.